Wembley welcomes the top two teams in the country as Chelsea and Tottenham Hotspur face off in a London derby with a huge prize at stake. A place in the FA Cup final, the tangible reward for success today, but perhaps a blow to be struck by the victor in the title race too. Games simply do not get much bigger than this. And that's a fine tackle from Ake. Great start to get from Nathan Ake. Lovely touch. Beautiful from Batshuayi on to Pedro. And Pedro might have a clear run at goal here. That's it. Uh, that's t- no, the referee's got a big call to make here. He may have to go for a red and he's gone for a yellow. He's going to argue that the ball had gone out, he'd lost control of it there when he nicked it away. That's a big, big call that he's had to make right there. Three minutes in, if he doesn't get the ball there, which he doesn't, I'm afraid there's a, that's going to go on and on. David Luiz and William, two experts at this sort of position. You think it's probably more favouring William because it's that bit closer to goal, but we shall see what they've been working on in the training ground this week. It is William, oh yes! What a start! What a brilliant free kick again from William! And what a hit, there is no doubt, Lloris takes a step. He takes a step to his right-hand side. He's used the wall there, and Lloris is partially at fault, but you've got to put it on target. And what a game, what a setup! No foul by uh, Ake there, referee eventually does pull it back. He certainly wasn't for the, for the county tackle, nothing wrong with that. This is important, you know, they've got a lot of top players out, you know that the back post, that so the Deli Ali is quite good at sneaking in. Well, Ericsson's a clever free kick into Kane, who gets his shot away, deflection on it, off Kante, takes it behind for a corner. So Ericsson is a man of Son lurking on the edge of the box, it's an absolute delivery. And as far as Son, picked up by Trippier. Ericsson again. And with his left, clever header, 1-1. Harry Kane with the equaliser for Spurs, it was a decent ball in. And Kane, the expert poacher, gets his 26th of the season. And Chelsea are pegged back. Eriksen. Cover from Nemanja Matic. Now here's Kante, maybe Chelsea can work something from midfield here with Matic finding Batshuahi. Options either side. There's Kante. Moses in all sorts of space to his right. Pass was short, Moses goes down, <laughs> referee's flagging for the linesman, it's going to be a penalty, yeah. it had to be a penalty, it was a really poor tackle by Son on Victor Moses. He's going to ground, you know what, you can't do it, you're taking a chance. What Huge an opportunity, William. right on half-time, William looking for his second of the semi, against Hugo Lloris. 2-1 Chelsea, sent him the wrong way, and the Blues have their lead back right before half-time. A William double, Chelsea 2, Tottenham 1. He likes this competition, William, he absolutely loves this competition. But two goals there, so I'm not used to playing in that position, but William, he's under a lot of pressure there. Well, there is half time, a frantic at times fabulous first half. It's Williams Wembley so far today. A brace for him, a free kick and a penalty either side of Harry Kane's equaliser. But it's Chelsea who have the advantage at the break in the FA Cup semi final. The score is Chelsea 2, Tottenham Hotspur 1. Chelsea victorious in five of their last six FA Cup semi finals. No, no wins in eight for Spurs. Very much for these players out there, of course. Here at this stadium, and very real. That's a great ball from Ericsson, and what a goal to bring it level at 2 2 from Deli Alley. It was just a sumptuous pass from Christian Ericsson, which completely undid the Chelsea defence. That is an absolutely world class ball. Okay. First touch out to Moses. Moses has done really well against Trippier. And look at the pace of Victor Moses here. Well done, Victor Moses. You can see at the end of the game here. The <laughs> shift he's done. Chelsea's first corner, a good opportunity here. And he did it, David Luiz. It's broken for Eden Hazard! Oh, what a goal! Eden Hazard in front of the Chelsea supporters with a screamer. He keeps it down, he keeps it perfect, he keeps it low. And it zapped into the ball. He could have had the last shot here, but he doesn't. He takes a touch. Keeps it low. That's smashed into the side netting. There is no way that Lloris is going to 
to get to that, threw a period of bodies as well. It was a clear standing and a vaguely offside position, Aki, but he's not interfering with the play there. And 3-2, uh, what a game. Fabregas, great run from Fabregas, onside, got it back to Hazard. Costa almost took it off his toe. Matic will have a third. Oh, my word! What a goal from the man, Matic! His first of the season, and he saved it for the big occasion to send Chelsea, maybe, to the FA Cup final. He has caught that, he has lashed that. And I tell you what, if the keeper tried to make a move to go for that, by the way, well done, Cesc, and well done for, you know, I didn't have a had to see it, so Oh, but really, wow! <laughs> what a goal! Glorious, he hadn't scored in almost a year, Nemanja Matic. Do you know what? You know, if I wasn't a Chelsea fan, I'd feel slightly sorry for Hugo Lloris, because you know what? How many three brothers could be in goal three? He's not saving that. And this is a great moment for Chelsea. Chelsea are through to the FA Cup final. Antonio Conte's first season in English football could yet end in double delight. A thriller minute game, a six goal thriller, which the Blues have come out on top in. Nemanja Matic crowned it with a goal that we'll never, ever forget. It's another final appearance for the Blues. What a day, what a performance. Chelsea 4, Tottenham 2.